Oh, yeah. Me and Despy are back. We're back for more Baldur's Gate 3. Uh, the last stream was... Hey. Excuse me. Hey, no. Excuse me. Hey, no. Hey, no. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Hi. I'm back. Um, the last stream was one of the more insane gaming sequences I've ever experienced, and we came out the other side feeling confident, in, well, honestly, with ill-placed confidence. We uh, were in a fully bugged state, and we're no longer in that fully bugged state, and we have Shadowheart right there. <laughs> oh, maybe she's gonna get busted later. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna figure it out. We're gonna figure it out. And on map picks in Northern Grotto, bordering the Ebon Lake. Uh, one of the drugning, or drugning mushrooms sends us up and split. Chunky one, two. Months worth of soup, at least. The rest were too busy droning to put a fuss. Nair pays us, and I'm bolting for Mantle Dareth. Thrin's orders be damned. They got eel steak, mineral mead, top land food, all sorts. Ooh, 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 ooh. Big Bird says, in case you're curious, a little bit of an old saving tried to use Glut to spore servant to dead companion. It's actually not possible under normal circumstances. Yeah, I know you, like, I was running away and uh, Glut, Shadowheart full died. And then before combat ended, that's when Glut rezzed my dude. That was incredible. All right, let's talk to some people. What up, Morgan? What are you looking at? Move. Okay, let's not talk to Morgul. So, the thing that I'm pretty pretty pumped about is the potential to get to this adamantine forge, but like I'm almost I'm almost a little bit overwhelmed. There's like so much stuff here, man. Hmm. Deep gnome make. But the design is anything but. What was this fort? Watch, watch. They've let it. Dana. Reinforcements, huh? Let's see how long you last. Everyone is. Everyone here is a hater. Dude, let me tell you. Nope. Mm, absolutely not. But you'd be killing history itself. This I should speak up. How peculiar. Smooth face, cobbled edges. Dude, there I just can't believe the amount of content. It's incredible. Be. Clan Sen, my friend. My sore eyes have seen what they're able. Care to offer yours in their stead? Uh, a suspiciously eager welcome from a Dwergar. Ease your suspicions. I've got no mind for slaving. My passion is stone, and my god is the chisel. What does that even mean? These learned eyes reach their limits, and so I must humbly request yours. Fine. What should I be looking at? The rock, the rubble, I'm, I'm all just, of it. If I may be so bold, I'm gonna take prickly, a prickly little dwarf. Tell me what you see, and be thorough. All right. Oh, is this the statue for technique in composition? Oh my god, please. Give me some guidance. Yeah, perfect 10, not a problem. Oh, I actually barely did it. Okay, that's my bad. The statue's meandering curves and golden edges stand out against the weathered masonry behind it. Two styles, two eras. The statue was carved from newer stone and erected by latecomers to this ancient fortress. Yes. Tell me, Amelia. Standing out. Um. Let's see here. All right, perception. Oh, I can just do all these. All right, we got guidance. We're gonna roll that ten. Damn, I'm kill I'm killing the game here, man. Success. Excellent. Several glassy stones stand out in the debris. Their borders are coated with tiny yellow crystals. 
The hottest of flames smoothed the stone and left sulfuric crystals behind. Uh -huh. The fires of the hells have touched Grimforge. Ooh. Alright, examine the fallen rubble. Alright, use my, my dwarf powers here. Oh, two to five bonus. Dude, not a natural one, please. Woo, that was pretty close. Oh my god. Okay, 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 okay. Continue, continue, continue. Boulders and stone bricks of various sizes clutter the corridor. Ooh. Many split cleanly in two. Yet some walls remain fully intact. No quake brought these rocks down. Three plus one plus they one. How we do it? Through in an instant. Something big charged through here. Something very big. Very big. What do you think? What? Uh, uh, fancy bridges, are you? There is nothing fancy about good work. Respect the stone. Or it may crush you. Oh, he's been waiting to use that line for years. He says that actually way too much. His friends are exhausted from that line. Incredible. An entire history risen from dirt and debris. Picture it. An ancient city. Hewn from the stone by disciples of Shah. Later abandoned. Untold centuries later. A new tribe revives it. Yeah. Fresh walls. Fresh sculptures. What we told you. Uh -huh. Until yeah. a great hell beast charges through, toppling the walls and crushing the people. Rock and stone. Yeah, no. Oh, that explains the infernal plate I found. Perhaps you might have use of it. Uh, my girlfriend, Carlac, would. <laughs> but my work has only begun. There is more still to find. I, must I worship chisels and have a mediocre friendship with hammers. All right, uh, I would like to trade. Well, let's see what you've got. Uh, okay. Uh, uh, goodness. Antidotes, antidotes. Let me combine these. Let me not do any of that. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Time to offload some garbage. Got some infernal alloy. I don't know what that's used for, but... Feels like it's a little crafty. Broken loot. Uh, silver goblet. Don't need this. I have no idea what I would use for onyx. There's, like, cool crafting things later, but, you know, whatever. Combine some of this stuff. Candle. I don't know why I'm holding that. Engraved Githyanki disc. Oh, yeah, I gotta show it to what's... Oh, yeah, letter to year. All right, let's do this and this and this and this. All my scrolls I used to not keep, but now I keep. Even it up. Trade! And we're gonna go to Carlac, who is hanging out over here with a Wizard's Bane oil. Sure. Yeah, I, I really don't know what a lot of these collectibles do, but I tend to sell things that sound... Don't have any alchemical value. I guess this does have value. Throwing some of the weapons out. This is a alchemical ingredient. Ritual staff. It's in Valen's pack. Wait, wait, wait. Dude, I have just so much garbage hanging out here. Pretty pricey. Uh, this is a silver necklace. Yeah. Who am I kidding? Oh, I can't do more than one at once. All right. Uh, what else you got? Definitely want these roaring thunder arrows, like 100%. Uh, let's go ahead and border. All right, uh, even more. Hey, Revivify Scrolls. Fuck yeah. We use those a lot around here. Void Bulb. Hmm. I now understand what it means. Um. What? Are there any potions that this guy has? Because I really need to stock up on those. Oh, there's a trap disarm kit. All of them, please. Both of 
thieves tools barter and we're done oops hit that button and we're done okay all right all right so what I'm, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna do a little bit of reorganization let's go ahead and type and I want to make I want to see if get me out of the sorting options ah click here and then look up uh where's crafting supplies really rarer oh who doesn't have an alchemy pouch camp supply alchemy Carlock, he doesn't have an alchemy pouch whoops everything just loads right in there fuck yeah fuck yeah What's in Balin's bag? I'm just gonna drop this. I'm just gonna drop this. There we go. Uh, and I think we're ba I think we're, you know, I think that's, I think we're, we're pretty done here. I have all these letters, letters to Kagha, let me just, Drop this, letter to handbell, let me drop that, letter to tattered scroll, let me throw that, I guess. Uh any any other junk that I want to get rid of? I think I think we're pretty good. Alright. Onward to exploring. Ooh. Alright, well, let's go ahead and let's go ahead and keep guzzling this shit. Tired, sleep, rest, little one. But do not take long. I feel his shadow. I heard his name whispered. The rock shivers from the sound. Dude, this is just an animal. What? Who does this as a developer? It's little to you, yet your heart pulses to its rhythm. Form, 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 form. You fear this catharic thorn. Do you perhaps need a snare and a high hat to go along with your thorn? All right. Mm. Mighty elf, cloaked in darkness. Wow, ten masters ago, and ten more. But I remember there was the work. And the blood. There was the Thorm's army. Thorms. There was the hell beast that broke them. The Ketheric Thorm's name faded into stone until the near came. This beast is so much smarter than the other beast that I killed. Miss Master Scritches. Impressive memory. How old are you exactly? I outlived my mother. And her mother's mother, and many mothers beyond. Blessed to see I'm many about five moms old. Cursed to see many die. Do you want to, like, be my friend? What kind of hell beast could have destroyed Catherick's army? I saw tusks and flesh, smelled fire. This is an animal, eggs. dude. It came with the mask men, crashing. And smashing. Uh, that was a long time ago. What does Nier have to do with Kithrin? I know not. So I say not. Yet I hear his name again. Said by the shadows. I just, I want to be able to pet things, though. Afraid. Afraid of Thorm. Do not think on it further. Rest. I will scared want you. scritches and food. Alright. Uh dude, who's this? Hmm? Oh are those two still talking. Dude, I am I'm absolutely still gutted. At, at that poor deep broth that I... I mean, I was forced to slay. You saw it, right? 
Oh, nice. Roll of Detect Thoughts. Damage Justicia. Candle? No. Hmm. Oh my god, a Jark Justicia's journal. I know it is forbidden to enter the Inquisitor's chambers, but I could not help myself. Has Master Catherick not commanded us to use every possible tool to best try his rivals? I mean, besides, Sybil meant to keep the amulet secret. She would have hidden it better. <sighs> Cycle 40 and 2. The amulet has gifted me a power, an energy, heretofore unknown to me. I've never known such might and such cheer. I can barely keep myself from smiling, much to others' chagrin. I see. Ha 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 ha. Cycle 45. It is done, thank the, the Dark Lady. Sybil tipped the amulet from my throat and cast into the lava. Having found me wrecked by laughter. The madness has lifted, but I do not yet know my penance. Sybil is not known to take pity on thieves. Did Mist XD says I'm traveling to LA for the first time in my life in November. Any recommendations on places worth, worth seeing or things worth doing? Food. Literally food in Los Angeles. If you look at the skeletons, you realize they are all clad in the same dark armor. Dark Justicia uniforms. These were Shah worshippers. The same as me. And then they shopped at Hot Topic. Um, uh, some recommendations are Osteria Mozza. Unbelievable Italian food. It's it's quite expensive, so like... <laughs> it's not the sort of thing that I'd be able to go to like every week. But like, mm, you want to have something to save up for? That's great. Um, Verstkuch is like deluxe sausages. They have a, a it's like a, a, a duck and jalapeno sausage that is insanely good. Um, and I get a La Trappe quadruple ale when I go there. It's really good. Uh, other things, other good food places, uh, Hei Jang Chon Korean barbecue uh, at 6th and Serrano is my favorite Korean barbecue in the city. Uh, they don't take reservations, so be sure to wait for like, um, you know, two hours. Um, what's another good place to eat? There's this place called Los Molcajetes. And I know I'm kind of not pronouncing any of these things with a lot of effort, uh, but um, it'll make it easier for you to like write it down and then Google it. Uh, Los Molcajetes is a great pupusa place. Best pupusas ever. Don't get anything that isn't pupusas there. Um, is there anything else good? George's in Long Beach is good Greek food. Yeah, never, never, never had it. Never had it. Uh, also, if you see any street tacos, just get them. Just fucking get the street tacos. All right, that's enough. There's five recommendations from me. Uh, whatever killed them made an enemy of a powerful goddess. Whatever killed a bunch of Sharans might still be down here. Just saying. All right, let's let's see. I got some medium armor. Let's go ahead and clear this. This new medium armor that I got is dark Justicier mail. Rare light armor. Obscured by shadow, the wear deals one point of correct damage to attackers that hit them with a melee attack. This one is really good. When the wearer deals radiant damage, they cause a radiant shockwave. Oh, yeah. No! You, grab a cane and whip these droogenin beasts into shape. That rubble needs clearing. And my patience is hanging on by an arse whisker. I hate this guy. Uh, you want me to you want me to cane these poor beasts? Okay, hold this. You stop. You get those uh, whiskers trimmed. A dwarf asking a dwarf for help. Bez, you stop when you get those whiskers trimmed. Volunteering, are you? Well, we ain't getting paid to flirt. Might not get paid. Is this what my character was supposed to be like? Uh, do your own dirty work. Don't think I won't thrash you harder than the Roth, eh? Something spooks the dumb shits. So stop your join and get to work. Yes? Oh, give me a break. Um, I know these creatures well. 
You should get in a, uh, you want to thrash me? Go on, then. Drugnin Hoon, I'll split you from head to hole. All right. Bloody Rose, they have lost it. Put him down. What? What? No. I thought, I'm not, I don't want to murder these guys. Agitated. Ready to attack at the slightest scare. A better position. Oh shit. Hmm. Go for the throat. He's the highest level. Use cunning action dash to just retreat back here quickly. Hmm. Now, this is my happy place. All right, Oop, uh, lower this one, and I'm gonna try not to kill the these guys. <laughs> I'm gonna try to put these to sleep. I'm gonna see if I can save the animals, alright? I like animals. Reckless. Or shit. Oh, I know what I'm fucking doing. Hmm. So I, 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 have, I have the plan. 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 So here's what we're going to do. We're going to do sleep. Up to how many hit points? Up to 24. So we're going to actually have to do level 2 so we can put this to sleep. And this to sleep. And that's that's good. Now what other bonus action can I do that isn't useless? An extra action. Yeah, I think I will. What's my chance to hit? I'm gonna go away so that way I can keep these guys asleep. Breathe deep. All right. And move. I messed up. <laughs> oh my god, the dude is trying to attack them because they're asleep and they stay asleep until they're awoken. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh fuck. Oh shit. Um, do you have hold person? I mean... Dude, just cure, cure, cure wounds, please. Carlac. Alright. Okay, this is what we should have done in the first place. How do I get this angle correct? So I really want... I gotta save that. I gotta save that little, that little cow, man. Sleeping, good. Okay. 
So watch this. Okay. All right, that's another round. There, there that is. Okay, all right. Well, glad everyone got the chance to watch. Bonus action, pummel strike. 80%. Reckless. Oh, fuck yeah. Oh, shit, no, fuck no. Under their noses. Oh, that's some good damage. Please, please don't kill this dude, man. Dude, I, I am such a chaotic gamer. Let me see if I can actually put... Dude, hold person, please. Yes! Yes! Hide again! Hide again! On I go. Topple him. This is the game. Alright, I have to shoot him. Uh yeah, let's just Ooh, wander over here. Let's cut with fire, oh yeah, I forgot that this guy's down here. He's he's just knocked out cold. Oh yeah, he's, he's just, he's just, whoa, 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 get, whoa, 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 whoa. Alright, so I will hit this guy. Ooh, Can't even catch my breath. Uh. Can't slow down. Yeah, I mean, I can just, some can't trip and yeah. Ooh, that's that's some that's some good stuff. Whoa, what, what? No, 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 no. Okay, ev everyone, everyone, ignore this. Wait, do I have another sleep effect? I'm pretty sure I have a scroll of sleep. That's a shadow heart, shadow heart. I want you to use that scroll of sleep. Let's just put this guy back to sleep again. All right, let's. We we love animals. That's it. We just. I love animals. Animals are great. Yeah, two turns of sleep. That's totally fine. All right, this guy doesn't look so tough. Yes. Fuck. What's yes. it gonna take? One. Find a route. All right. So we're doing that. Well, so much for peace. Need to find a way forward. And then we're going to crouch. Something than a whisper. Sleeping. Shadow heart. I want oh, you to run. I want you to actually take a. We're just literally gonna come back because I want to talk to him. All right, all right. Over here. Go, 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 go. Cunning action dash. We're gonna hide. I mean, I love this little cow guy. God, it's hot in here. Heading out. All right, so. Again, cunning action dash. Nothing important is ever easy. On my way. Can't attack what can't be seen. Can't attack what can't be seen. I'm a little jelly bean. Well, I'll do it my way. Don't linger. All right, let's see what's over here. Yo, holy shit! Oh my god, that's awesome! Oh my god, yeah. Ooh. 
No, I hit C, you fuck. Don't waste a step. Okay, let me see if I can save this guy. Dude, come on, give me a break. Heading there. Yes, here. See if I can just dash away from this guy while hiding. Moo. Dude, cows are awesome. I love cows. How does this guy know? I got this. C, Ooh, not space. Go. Jimmy on the go. God, she has insane movement. Never a dull moment. Time to press ahead. Alright, so I mean I'm gonna continue to dash away. I'm obsessed with the idea of just making sure this cow is is heard of. Okay. Heading there. Oh my god, we get to save one cow in this game. This is the best. This is it! Go this way? Wait, what? I can go down, down? Oh, we're doing this shit for sure. Oh my word. This Please area hide. is gigantic. This whole game is so much bigger than I expected. I'm still in Act 1. I'm 50 hours into Act 1. I mean, I know I'm kind of generally a little bit more of a slow and thorough player, but like the amount of shit that I have done that is insane. Time to push my luck again. All right, let's go ahead and keep keep on, keep on, keep on dashing. Right on, Sean. Happy seven months Another in a row. Thanks forward. for your warm support. Oh what? All right, dude. If I if I have to kill this thing, I'm gonna be really upset. Can't believe. That I put one to sleep and the guy just instantly one shot it. This is gonna feel good. How many turns of nothing? That's no blood. Uh. On my way. Oh, am I actually going to go down? Nice. <laughs> Incoming. All right, this is it. Shall we dance? Keep them guessing. Oh my god, we're going to go back. We're going to save that guy. Choice, right. but to keep going. Wonder if the gods are watching me. I wonder if the gods are watching me. That's all of us. We're the gods. Pamphlet is the only thing bigger than this game is my butt. Kapow, got him. Easy. Wanna know. Best Yo, dude, hell yeah. Ah, oh, man. Man, all right. He's, he's pissed. He's... Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I mean, I tried to save you. I, I wish it wasn't this way, but it is. It is this way. I 
I feel terrible. I feel terrible. I feel terrible. I'll just help myself. Well, problem is that there was loot. Never you know, it's, it's hard to avoid when there's loot. Uh, whipping cane. Wow. All right. Not much use for this slag. Nice speckles, though. Oh yeah. I'm done. I can't wait to sleep. Wait. I vaguely remember animal friendship being in this game, but I don't know if that was like a perk or a spell or whatever. Catch a break. Either way, super sad. Super sad. Had to, had to kill. I had to kill. I didn't want to kill, but, you know, I was kind of forced to against my will, which is, you know, it's not my fault. That that happened certainly is someone else's fault, however. So this is interesting. I'm kind of curious about this other side of things, but let me... Let's reorient the map. Is there an, a reorientation button here, actually? Okay, so here we go. I see where I am now. I wonder what this means. It's a different layer. Yeah, it looks like looks like dude, the verticality in this game is unreal. So, you know, I, I'm kinda curious to Moving ahead. Check out this kind of area back here. Like where does this go down to? You know? Whoa! Oh boy. You know, I took yesterday off streaming because I was just I was just too tired. I, I didn't stream on Monday evening and I also didn't stream on Wednesday. And I'm still tired. <laughs> yeah. Texan Texan till I die. Says I'm straight up amazed at how they handle the verticality in the camera. It's ten times better than I expected. It is a lot better than I expected. Come on, old nutby. Too far, too high. Hey, good looking. That's me. I'm good looking. She said so. Phew. Open up. Let's get some more perception checks over here, please. Looks like a trap there. Trust no one. Stay on. Over here. All right, so let's go ahead and disarm this. Let me go ahead and add some guidance here. I, I think we can do this. I'm also inspired. Plus 11. Great. Cool. <laughs> Casual plus 10, plus 2. No problem. Dwarga's legs too short. It's true. It's true. I can only kind of scoot. Anywhere a Segway can go, I can go. Or maybe anywhere a Roomba can go, I can go. <laughs> Open up. The real Sparky Sparks wall. Lightning aura. Hmm. -mm. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Open it up. Sounds looking like some more gale feed, if I'm being honest. Fun little detour. Okay. 
Okay, so how do we get down over to here? Look at all the chests, dude. Night time to rest. Light on my feet. All right, where's where's the feather fall? Whoa, where's the feather fall? Here we go. Do I have six of them? Oh yeah. Up, 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 up. Where's the feather? There it is. All right, feather fall for 10 turns. Yo, 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 yo. There's no time to waste. Come here. Let's try this way. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come here, come on. This is how I talk to my dog when she gets distracted while we're walking. I'm like, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. Pay attention. All right. Oh my god, it took this game long enough. It's a mimic. Fuck. God, that guy is... So 50, 50... Alright, target is too close. What do we have, son? Pro probably. Probably shouldn't. Oh, I'm encumbered? Oh, dude, nutby. Oh my god, no wonder you're having a hard time. Uh, let's get rid of this. Scorching ray, I guess. Target is too close. Alright. Aha! <laughs> yeah. Ooh, ooh, I'm gonna do this. Surprise. Dude, Astarion has started to deal so fucking much damage. Woo! Woo! Let's move. Let's go up there. Heating up. Alright, so I'll probably just do, use a little frenzy action. I never really do this. Ah! Reckless. Uh, well, I guess we'll just attack again, like this. Good job. Have you wander up here and stop. Mimic. Pseudopod Lash. Oh, do these have such low movement? I assume these wouldn't be ranged, because I play Dark Souls. All right. Uh, do I still have this advantage? Cancel, click this, shoot this. God, Astarian is just so sick. Alright, so I mean... What's, what, what scrolls? Scroll of Blur? Dude, I'm, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna move some of these damage scrolls over. Scroll of Burning Hands. Where's, where's just a cool scroll? It's a cool one, huh? Scroll of Ray of Frost? Yeah, here, enjoy a scroll of Ray of Frost. Yeah, there you go. Shoot him. I feel powerful. Got to move. Alright. Another fight. Let's go. Another fight. Hmm. Let's go. Hold on, I gotta shrink this again. My brain doesn't work well with this. So let's actually, uh, how about I just twin it? Shoot you. Oh, okay, okay, because he's short. I see. Because my character is short, I'm gonna go ahead and meta magic twin spell. Yeah, backing it up. I mean, I'll just I'll just shoot from afar. 
Yeah. Nut B, of course, of course takes the huge damage. Of course not. All right, so I'm gonna move over to here. Yeah, I mean, this, this is just gonna be a death. Can't give up. Can't give up. Dude, I'm just gonna cantrip some sacred flame here. Usual, typical, expected, common result. A common W for villains. Uh, yeah, I mean, I'm literally just cantripping this guy because I don't really see a reason to do much more. Oh, I'm so encumbered, dude. All right, Karlak, it's go time. Tactical. Walk to here. Walk to here, and then yeah, there it is. Boom. Can we actually deal that much damage? I mean, I don't think so, but. 16 is pretty good, and 13 is pretty good. Save, bite. All right, that, that was pretty good, efficient use of resources. And I have way too much shit on me, don't I? Yeah, I think it's just all that armor that I picked up was like not actually paying attention. And Carlac is about to go to Mule Town. Here we go. Skybreaker. You yeah, dude, look at how much this shit weighs. Four and a half, nine, twelve, nine. All right. And now perhaps time for real treasure. Boots have mm -hmm. seen everything. Wondrous gloves. Your armor claim is by one addition. If you have bardic inspiration, you gain one more use of it. Never, ever gonna, ever need to worry about that. Let's have a look. And dude, can I just say the storytelling of that is so clever that it's gloves implying someone reached for the chest and then it bit their hands off. I mean, that's so good. Hand axe. All right, uh, who, who are those gloves gonna go on? Me? I forgot to put on gloves, huh? These are advantage on melee attack rolls while surrounded by two or more foes. I mean, increasing AC by one is pretty good. She's in the front way more often. Well, these are all just equipped. Sure. Hey, can, can someone actually explain to me what that mist is around Shadowheart. Is that temporary hit points? Is that what that actually means? This is an actual backseat question. I mean, this is pretty incredible. Oh, wait, whoops. Yeah, that's, that's what we actually want you to be wearing. Great. Yo, Kalatization, kind of rough lately. Not been able to keep up the stream, but made my first 30 days at the gym for 30 more days. Dude, Kalado, or excuse me, Kalado. <laughs> I called you the name of a character in a game. Hmm. Toy chest, what? Oh dear. Someone's left a trap out. Wait, chest? All right, cool. Dude, that's that's fantastic. I've also started being a little gym baby Keep myself. Mm. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and disarm and lockpick. All right, give me that bonus. Ship it. One time. <laughs> okay, wait, but I'm inspired. But I was inspired earlier. It's fine. I'm inspired. And... Oh, yes. From 1 to 19. The story of aging. Success. Continue. 
Uh, we still need a lockpick. With though. pleasure. You're with pleasure. Oh. All right, twenty to roll. Eleven plus four plus that plus three plus three. It's like it's like way too easy. It's like way too easy, literally. Success. Potion of glorious vaulting. Wait a damn minute. Scroll of evidence. To the Emerald Enclave and those deemed worthy to see this record, greetings from those who harp. Know ye that one known as Ketherick Thorne, Paladin of Shar, is guilty of crimes against body and spirit. They include, but are not limited to, murder, slavery, and desecration of temples most holy. Let our intent be known. An alliance between the Harpers and the Emerald Enclave. United, we may end Thorm's reign of terror. Uh, yeah. Okay, so... Dread Nightly. Okay. Huh. I mean, that's pretty... I mean, we could... I think we could make it, maybe. I think maybe we could make it. Looking ahead. I should mind my step. So do these guys hate me now? No, that's fine. They didn't know nothing, man. Oh, yes. Go into that chest over there. Yeah. Wait. What? There's a whole lot. Oh, my God. Oh my god! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I don't even real- oh. Wait, get over here. Okay. Alright, so if I jump... Let's cook in. Satellite. Wait a fucking minute, dude. Can I do? Oh, I've never done dumb shit like this yet. Oh, yeah. Okay, here we go. No. Oh, yeah. Yes. Holy shit. Hold on, Carlock. Let me. <laughs> yes. All right. What's in the pouch? I don't know. Got some slag. Dude, and the reason I did this is because, look, there's like clearly a little thing here. So, you know, I may as well. Oh, a devil foil mask. Oh, just gonna put on a little devil foil. You know, treat myself. There you go, loser. Probably equip him with a useful helmet someday. Uh oh, saving. Uh oh. We are going up, dude. Whoa. 
what the, f how is this place so big? It's so huge. And this is what I was talking about earlier about verticality and like the power of verticality is that like, it, it just creates a lot of opportunity for surprise. Um, how do I, how do I actually do this? Let's Is go to our blood? other party members. No, never mind. All right, let's... What's in here? Don't waste a step. Okay, can we... All right. Okay, hold on. Oh, oh. Okay, let's get some more stuff over here. Dude, if this works, then this is then this is the game right here. <laughs> this is This is one of the best playthroughs of any game. Is this playthrough of this game? Oh yes. <laughs> Every single week has been absolutely fucking insane. Alright, can I can I I mean, every single, every single week has been just increasingly ridiculous. Dude, Carlac shows us the way, shows us what's possible. Let's go to Carlac. I think, I think the barrel is not a good thing. But I don't think it even lets me jump on the barrel. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we're we're getting close. We need we need one more box. Come with me, wee box. All right. We are playing Minecraft. Okay. So if I can hop up here and then hop up <clears throat> what's interrupting my path let's see we are oh we are fucking so close to doing it i see now i see now because look i need a I just need to scoot this over here. Get off. Okay, wait. We need one more box. We just need one more box. Because what's going to happen? Oh, yo, dude. Can I stand on this? No, I can't. We need a closed box. Okay, wait. Perfect. Perfect. Right this way. So... Are we I don't want to talk to you. Get, get me out of here. I'm fine with either, naturally. The last thing I want to do is ruin these nails digging through rock. What are you talking about? <laughs> but, well, of course we can leave here. But if you insist on being a hero, I won't get Look at this dumb way. mask. Just don't expect me to help either. Who, who is he talking about? Who is he talking about? I don't know. Okay. Oh, see, he's, he's got a serious case of the baby face. 
All right, so if I can now, because it is jump. Okay. <gasps> Fuck yeah. Yes. <laughs> Come on in, get in there. All right, your turn. Shadow heart, get in here. Nice. All right. In you go, Astarion. Can't give up now. Can't give Never up wanted now. the easy path. You have no idea what hoops I jumped through for you. Yes, dude. Yes. Oh my God, dude. This <laughs> we are just an absolute sloppy gamer, man. Let's move. Let's move. Another step forward. I'm gonna just take a short one. Oh. Ah! Oh, dude. Fuck yeah. Right? Am I right? Or what? Oh, dude. <laughs> Good thing I killed everyone in that fucking room. Oh my god. Cold Pete says, now can you get back out? I, I don't answer questions. I don't answer questions. Something's off. Pure shadow. Step carefully. There's a trap. Found it. Garlack. Well, well, well. Oh, interesting. All right, so. Me? Dude, I, I don't know where I don't know where I am, man. All right, where's my health potion? I don't have it. Moving in. Moving in. Okay, so what we are going to do is look in the vases. A trap. Someone doesn't like visitors. Subtle steps. Someone's left a trap out for us. What does this even mean? Is it that that I step on? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm curious. Moo! Moo, my dude. Indeed. It'll be okay. See that? See how I just intuited the RNG? Got incredible. Okay, I, th I think I see how it works now. There's a trap. Come on, let's go! Ah! Ah! Get in a fucking group! Fucking get the fuck over here! Get fucking get down there! If you insist. Get fucking get down! Get the fuck down there! Go! 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 Fucking run! Oh my god! Where, where am I? Oh, hiding. Hello. Oh shit, everything got triggered. Dude, dude, this game's traps are the most... I'm not fucking around. That's trap kind of traps I've ever seen in the game. Like, these, these, these games... Jeez Louise, like, I mean, my god. Like, when the traps go off, you, like, die.
Okay, so... Oh, I see. So, this can come over here and we can't get on it. Okay, so so let's let's come up with some decisions here. Anything useful over here, we think? Oh, big ol' chest. Big ol' chest is best. So Carlac is probably my... Let's march. ...strongest person. Okay, so I'm gonna have you climb up here. So here's like a semi-safe position. Oh, those actually turn off. Wait for this thing to go. One more. Two. Two. Oh, get the fucking get down there. Yeah, fuck yeah. Alright, awesome. Tongs. Oh, I, I love it so much. I don't know what ropes for, but I do already have two. A little baby armory over here. Got some sacks. Excellent. Rotten carrots. Hell yeah. Love rotten carrots. And axe. Of course. Of course, why would I not? It's so crazy to play a game where the traps are actually scary. As opposed to, like, the trap goes off and it's just like, Oh, yeah, you suffered, like, seven damage. Like, this is like, they go off, they continue to go off, and they will just continue to shit on you endlessly. Like, that's sweet. Can we? Dude, yes, Carlac, yes! Oh my god, dude, yeah, fuck yeah, dude. Dude, yo, look at Carlac, go, oh my god. Absolute James Bond over here. This is amazing. It's even over this way. I mean, I might want to rejoin with the party, but, you know, curiosity has never caused any issue at all in these games for me. So I don't see why that would start anytime soon. And? All right. What in the shit is up here? Oh, there's a traitor. Look up there, would you? That shit fools. I ain't this flank. Dude! Dude! Yes! Big <laughs> okay, I see. So I can actually explore this area in multiple ways. Oh, that's insane. So... Here's where my guys are. You can see the other map underneath, so I can just like wander into this central area. <laughs> oh yeah. Alright. So I can jump over to here. Some stuff over there. I think we may as well just get the party in, huh? Long sword mold. For me. Oh my god. Hey, remember? We needed molds. We needed molds. That's what the content was telling us. Oh my god, yes. 
Ooh. What up, party? All right. What to do? All right. All right. So Nut B is just gonna jump up here. We're gonna we're actually gonna get the whole party in. All right. Let's lower this down, and then let's mage hand like there. All right, hand it to us. Fuck yeah. Still breathing, despite everything. Dude, yes. Yes, 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 yes. Dude, yes, yes! Ah. Oh. Light him up. All right, I'm going up. Dude, this game is so fun. If not over, then through. If I cannot fight them, then I will outsmart them. Is there anything in these vases? Dude, I've been using Mage Hand so much, best Ryan ever. Like, so much Mage Handed. You've got to Mage Hand it to me. Any insane places to jump to from here? Always willing to take a dive for no reason, you know? I mean, just the, the fact that you... It clearly implies that you can climb up to this way. Oh, my God. I would... I have never played a CRPG that has three-dimensional exploration like this. I see track. What happened here? It's hard to make any sense of this mess. Anything to jump to? Yeah, this door is the one I'm definitely going to go through next. This is like why I brought the whole party over. What was this good old door? Do I perhaps light both braziers? <laughs> Ungdom's good. Un Ungdom's Gaiden. Says, I have played your creative confidence clip five days in a row, and it brings me to tears laughing every time so far. Best wishes. Yes! My loss is your gain, baby. Oh, my God. I mean... Careful. I mind. Oh, uh, yeah, no, like, CRPGs are the, um... How did I unshroom Shadowheart? Uh, L Super Beast 2, it took me over an hour. Um, like, but a, a CRPG is a description for this kind of game, where it is like an isometric game that generally has 2D gameplay and 2D, um, well, let me, let me, let me clarify what I mean by that. There are games that, there's lots of games that are in 3D that have 2D gameplay. So something like, um, StarCraft is a really good example. StarCraft has three-dimensional objects, but things are actually happening in two dimensions. Like if you have someone on low ground and high ground, it's just another variable on a 2D plane where it says this person is on high ground. If you don't have vision, you can't hit him, yada, 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 yada. Whereas there's something like, oh yeah, 2D fighting game is a great example. Like Street Fighter takes place in a 2D plane, even though the characters are rendered in 3D. Um, and so when I say that this game has 2D gameplay, um, this is a little bit what I mean, where like, if you look at the map, like, I can traverse like this, and yes, in terms of the dimensionality, you can go up, but then, you know, you're largely interacting on two-dimensional distances and stuff like that. Something that's more like uh, Elden Ring, first-person shooters where you actually care about up and down and all this stuff. This game does have some three-dimensional gameplay. Like, obviously, if I'm trying to, like, shoot an arrow, it does take into account the fact that, like, this path would be blocked in this way, you know. Um, but for the most part, this genre historically, the CRPG genre, is 3D graphics, but it's 2D gameplay. And um, for those of you that are unfamiliar with the CRPG statement, there were games that were like this in the 
in the 90s and early 2000s. Uh, like Fallout 1, Fallout 2. Um, I, I'd put Neverwinter Nights and Icewind Dale into this category. Um, games that just have this viewpoint. Um, oh yeah, Baldur's Gate 1 and 2. I can't believe I forgot about those. Um, and the thing is, when you have 2D gameplay as a base, I cannot stress this enough. You think in those terms. You think within two dimensions. I was referencing StarCraft as a 3D rendered game that plays in 2D. You think about interesting ways that units can like move around in two dimensions. Acceleration and deceleration, that's fun to play with. A card game, I view it as putting cards down to a board from your hand. If you t said to me, hey, it's a three dimensional card game, I'd be like, I don't even understand what that means. Like with, with CRPGs, if you said there's 3D gameplay, I'd be like, I don't, I don't actually understand. Like how do you, I can't conceptualize what you're talking about. And this is just like, this is crazy. The fact that like I started off down there, I could have easily just waltzed down to this area. Oh man, looks like rot, rot. Got a brain of your own. Use it. Like, but I'm above. Like the 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 way that the camera is placed. This is so fucking hard to do, <laughs> and not have it clipping or 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 moving in a jarring fashion. Like, notice that when I am over this gap. It stays at this plane, and then if I keep going to the right, it occasionally intelligently shifts up or down in, like, really subtle ways. I'm not actually doing it in this environment, but it it did in the other ones. And, I mean, this environment is so vertical, it probably makes sense. Is Rocket League a 3D game to you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. The, the, it has 3D gameplay. Again, that's what I'm trying to delineate between. The um, 3D in terms of graphics and 3D in terms of gameplay. And, and just the, the the idea for someone to go like, dude, what if we just did like a CRPG style game, which generally has 2D gameplay. Dude, let's just fucking go 3D with it. Let's make it super vertical. Um, that the amount of tech that you have to very carefully handcraft to make sure that the camera doesn't do stupid things, to make sure that the environment is visually trackable. Probably have to iterate on that art a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Because remember, Top down is the viewpoint. So this is why so many games that were uh, CRPGs don't do verticality unless it's just like we are loading level one of the fortress and then you go down the stairs and it just loads level two. You never have them simultaneously getting displayed. Um, and so what you what this means is that you don't have to make roofs. All the roofs are invisible because you're just looking down into the area. I mean, this is... This is an incredible achievement. And the thing that, that that's funny is that, like, the camera has done weird, buggy, goofy shit frequently in air quotes. But the reason I say in air quotes is that, like, it has happened. But the amount of times it could have happened and didn't is staggering. It's absolutely fucking staggering. I mean, this is crazy. This is incredible. Grumble Zone says, I heard you speak very positively about fixed camera angles in the past. Do you feel like maybe you should have gone with that uh, in this case? Or does the free camera make it better? Let me um, take a step back and reframe um, the, the fixed camera angle point. Because um, I know how I talk. I like to be like, dude, fixed camera angles are the shit. Don't fucking give me control over your camera, you, you idiots. Because the thing is... I never want to have control over the camera if your game looks terrible at some of the angles. Why would you give me control? Like, for instance, let's say that this was the only camera angle. I couldn't zoom in. I couldn't rotate. Let's actually go to a traditional angle, right? So a 45 degree angle. If you said to me, this is the camera angle in the game. Great. And I can WASD around and that's awesome. The instant you give me control to like zoom in and then zoom out, you run the risk of having stuff look like shit. Like in this game, amazingly, as I'm zooming in, these characters, I mean, even though I've made a star and look goofy as shit, like these characters actually look quite good. And like, this is not as high resolution a model as is used when I talk to Carlock. 
We need to get that near guy unstuck. Well, those gnomes are done for. You can see a lot more Come detail on. here. For sure. Oh, it's near that's stuck. I mean, it's just it's just incredible the amount of, of visual detail. Also, there's a lot of cheating things you can do with ground textures, where if the ground texture stays at this angle, you don't actually have to show that it has, like, rubble and dimensionality here, but, like, when you zoom in, you run the risk of it, like, looking bad. But this game just went through so much effort to just make the assets look good and do things like the way in which it makes these things invisible as you're panning through it. Like, notice that these don't become invisible, even though they are obscuring our characters, but there is something with how this object is labeled in the environment that says, yes, do make that invisible. Like, look, look, this is like such a good example of the care of labeling environmental objects. And of course, like, if I go over here to this wall, we can make the wall become invisible as well. We absolutely can. But there's a lot of clever things, like this wall actually does leave some stuff behind to help give a sense of space. Like, th th this is, I think, one of the strongest examples that I could point to, that someone had to hand modify a flag and say, this thing does hide if you zoom in. These little things don't hide, and we're okay with that. And the way in which, like this, You'll notice that this this is kind of hard to see, but I'm going to try to explain it and then do it. When I go through the wall, it's going to be transparent. And right now, nothing is transparent. But if I go back to this camera angle, notice that it actually takes time. Like, notice I'm going to tap once, release. And then you'll see it slowly peels away. So in other words, like, it's not in this position be able to look through a solid object. Okay, now you're out of the position. Done. It's like instantly transparent, and then it takes a little bit of time to peel away again. Because you can see if I move it fast, it's kind of in a, in a constant motion slurping the visibility back up. There's like so many little touches like that that I just think are astonishing. Um, I, I just can't believe it. It's just it's just amazing. Don't give me trouble now. Oh, don't lockpick it. I'm going to cancel this. It's wrong. Cancel. What now? And the thing is that like th th these Simple. kinds of details, I think, are what make the game feel... It, it, or it's the kind of thing that makes the camera feel like frictionless. It's so utterly frictionless, just simply moving the camera around. And when we actually take time to look, it's like, well, that had to be individually controlled. This is clearly individually controlled. Oh, the wall is not clipping, but if I interpenetrate the wall and then exit it, it will stay transparent for a moment and then return. And how long does it take to do that? All those little things add up to feeling frictionless. And I've talked about this before, that when games are really, really well done, all the things that make them well done is, you know, you, you, can't, you can't even see that it's there. Like, I actually encourage you all to do this. Go on YouTube and look up, like, you know, a... Spring 2023 student film upload. And you'll get a whole bunch of like universities and colleges where you can actually see through, you know, all the stuff the kids uploaded at the end. And it will be things like, you know, I remember watching some student film of uh, a woman gets her purse stolen by a guy and she chases him down. Beats the shit out of him and takes her purse back. That was it, that was the entire clip. And the camera angle, what the, the way that the cameras kept cutting and like the fact that because this shot and this shot happen at different times of day, so the color's a little bit off, and and like where the elements were when it cut to the new frame, just, it was so jarring. And then you go watch a modern action movie, and it's just clear what's happening. <laughs> like you can just, 
it's not, and I'm not trying to say that the stunts and the performance and the drama was at a higher level. I mean, just like literally where the camera is placed and the fact that the colors match. And Or even if you watch student films that are not action sequences, it's like two people talking to each other. Just like how close the camera is, just like feels off and, you know, and when the cuts happen and how long they hang on the character of the dialogue, it just feels wrong. And then when you're watching TV, you don't even notice what the camera is doing because it's just so frictionless that you're just paying attention to what the people are saying. It's like that that quality of craft is so looking ahead. Amazing. I need a pound of those oceans. Oh, have to keep going. I have no idea where this is, but I'm I'm going in. I think that's one of those things that like is is kind of because I heard a lot of people uh, during the era when like GTA 4 came out and a lot of people were giving that like 10 out of 10 you know best game ever made sort of things there's a lot of people that are like dude but like you know you, you you're just driving a car around a city like you know there, there's a lot of stuff that's just not I mean I could go drive a car around a city in my own city <laughs> oh shit oh god that's not what I wanted to do all right And, oh, yeah, well, I guess the simulation is complicated, yeah. But, I mean, you know, some of the, the action sequences and the dialogue, you know, it's just sort of stuff I've seen before. You know, there's a lot of, like, talking about the way in which the game was like, well, I mean, it just seems kind of, seems kind of like, okay, but, like, not amazing, right? Like, I don't, I don't understand. And I remember there was this article that was, like, a publication justifying it's, like, 9 out of, or, or, or like, 10 out of 10 for this game, and they just pointed out how many things just are utterly seamless from one moment to the next, and that all these pairwise seams are just gigantic in number. Here are the mirrors. From dialogue to combat to a car chase, back to combat, dialogue in the car, times when, uh, you know, you're on a side quest and something dynamic happens and the way that the quest and the dynamic event blend together and it works great. I was just like, damn, that's, that's something I've always thought about ever since reading that, where it's just like, yeah, no, what, what are the things? These are Sharon weapons. I would recognize the Night Singer's blades anywhere. These are Sharon's weapons. Well, then look at them. All right, fine. So we're in this upper area. Oh, what do we have here? So I'll probably be entering in this area from... We could always jump down. I, I kind of want to do that because that is. Because I would jump from here down to this area. I'm explore up in this area a little bit first. Ooh! Nice little Easter egg. Shield mold, dude. Fuck yeah. Because remember, with the forge, you need a mold and a material. So we're gonna be able to craft some some stuff. Oh look, a stone bed. I, that does not make sense, man. Stone bed. Ooh. Ugh. Better not be cursed. What infernal legion? You know what, everyone? You know what? Oh, oh, oh. Oh, okay, that's fine. But I thought that was an Infernal Legion showing up on the other side. Hmm. 
Oh, for a skeleton key. Wait, what? Oh, shit. What can't undo now? Why not? Why not? I mean, that'll open it. All right, but here's here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna get everyone over here to hide. <laughs> Kinda don't want to drop down. Actually, I want to I want to see this because this area connects down to a deep deep exit down here. And then I think does this kind of wind around this way? This area might be a little bit cordoned off. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna have everyone hide. We're gonna have Nutby pull off, and we're gonna have Nutby become invisible. Maybe I should stay crouchy forever. <laughs> Swift as my feet can carry me. Right. Okay. Is there anything else in this room? Any other doors? An opulent chest, you say? All right. This guy does not like cold. Oh, dude, look at my little, look at my, look at my little ghost. Death won't take me yet. Just out of view. Damn. Okay. <laughs> so I want to actually go to the combat log and look at this. Uh, 13 cold damage. I just, I just literally rolled a 13. Okay. So let me actually just do a, a chromatic thing. Because I'm, I'm going to ice this. I'm going to ice this area. Yeah, we're all, we're all going to come to the high ground here, man. Cause now this is icy, so they can like slip and fall. Uh. Fuck yeah. Reckless attack, hundred percent. Reckless attack, hundred percent. All right, so what's this? Bardic Inspiration? Oh my god, I didn't know Karlak was such a bard. That's amazing. Let's turn someone inside out. Okay, so this guy is going to... Yeah, I mean, can I actually get this? Eleven to thirty-three. Yeah, I, I guess I'll just do this. Sounds like fun. It's kind of a goofy angle, but whatever. Very cool. Very very good. I'll probably sanctuary Carlac for the time being. Ha <laughs> ha! Fuck yeah! All right, get me out of the item menu. Where is sanctuary? Then I'm just gonna can trip some hot hot heat here. 
Eeg Mies. Always Mies. So now we have Super Sanctuary Karlak, who's like literally so fine. From attacks. Alright, so... One day I'll catch a break. Uh, do we have anything good? I mean, I'm really happy I, I have this as my as my thingy. Oh shit, I fucking electrocuted Carlac. Oh, I'm such I'm like a bad person, dude. Oh. Ha! Ooh! Ah! Alright, how much how much uh you know. All right, I'm just going to do a little bite here. Immune to poison. What's this? Uh, yeah, and that she can now also like bow it up. Oh, I actually feel a little bad for that hellbore. I don't feel bad for that hellbore. Jump up and jump around. Uh oh, using dash, getting close, we'll be able to attack. Shadow heart, dude. You know, I I am actually just gonna hit it with the with the staff, man. Time to meet your maker. Damn, damn! Look at that. Hell yeah. Oh hell yeah. I'm just gonna chill. And then I'm actually, after I've cleared out this area, I'm going to jump down. I do still need to investigate up here before I drop. Yo, what is up? What? What? Okay. It's not be a clock. All right, I'm just going to frost, frost blast. Got you. Oh, she's on. This is good. The girl on fire. All right, let me. Moving. I'm gonna slay from the bed, from high ground. Oh shit! Get me the fuck out of here. Yeah. Ugh. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, Carlac. Get him, Carlac. Yeah, Carlac, get him, Carlac. Alright, we got a dashing piggy. Oh, we got a jumping piggy. Ninety percent. This might be lethal. Number one, number one. Dude, would you just stop getting on fire, please? Dude, just what are you doing? What are you doing? Very well. Stop it. What's up for discussion? Go go to the ash. Okay, let me see if I can get this right. Maragon Halberd. Ooh. Ooh, we're taking this. Ooh, another devil foil mask. Oh yeah. Another mask. Heavier than it looks. Wouldn't be very comfortable. Can't believe the character heard what I said, man. That's crazy. You know, I should probably give Styron like an actually good helmet. Sure. Um uh, nice. Canticles of the Dark Mistress. Oops. Dish. Let shadow fall where the light doth creep, and silence cloak the den. Let blackness into lost hearts seep, and bid our lady in. Behold, Char who shades our path. Behold, Char from 
Owl born. Behold, Shar the primal dark, or goddess of night. Behold. Yeah, sure. Sure, sure, sure. You got it. You got it. Get nutby. Let's actually have a little party here. I want you to do your level two, like, healing all. And because she healed, we all have temporary hit points. The synergies never stop. Can't slow down. There's something good here. I hope. Blade Ward? Uh, wow. Fire Stoker. Deals more damage to burning targets. Nice. The elixir of heroism. Oil of accuracy. I love oils of accuracy. I love just getting things all oily because they're so accurate. But that will fit in my bag. Elixir of fire resistance. Actually so helpful. Ochre jelly? What? Ugh. All right, nice. Okay. So let's see here. We got the bow. And I think... Starion has the longbow. So if I select you and then move this here, and then I can actually look at the difference. This is 5 to 10. Yeah, I definitely want the longbow. All right. This is a light crossbow. This is a fire stoker. And it is just shitty. What? 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 Why is it so much more bad? You know what? I'm gonna hold the fire stoker. Yeah, I'm cool now, huh? No, I'm not cool at all, man. I'm gonna get this other thing out. Boom. There it is. Suppose I could find more one-handed crossbows and then be like dual wielding and be like, look at me, I'm an Overwatch hero. But I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna continue to scout around. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna clear out this area a little bit. And then I wanna actually jump down this side. This side is just titillating me. Need to find a way forward. I lied. I'm going there right now. Like, I, if, thing, if things are this titillating. Is that a level one? Yeah, feather fall. Here we go. Prime spot for an ambush. Nice rope. Someone used it to climb up here. What rope? What does that sound? Oh. This is the game. Ochre jelly, huh? Slashing resistance, lightning resistance. Hmm. Who's not here? What's next, I wonder? The battle. And it is Carlax's turn. All right, so this this is slashing resistant. What does that actually mean? It's have such an energy entity from non-magical attacks is halved. Okay. All right. All right, let's come on, come on, do, do your sword work. Yeah, ninety-five percent. Nice. I thought that's what was going to happen. So I actually want to first hit this guy. Ninety-nine percent advantage. Love to hear that.
That was awesome. All right, I'm going to back up because I'm working on the assumption this jelly probably can't move so fast. I wonder if this is worth the cost. How do you guys respond to ice? Very well. All right, running away. How do you guys respond to fire? Yes, you know, very impressive. There you go, baby. All right. There's some good stuff down here. All right, so I think I'm going to just change target priority and just burst this guy who's closer. Too heavy to throw. Okay. Frenzied strike. Nice. Frenzied strain? Oh, no. Ah, that's sweet. Okay. 95% chance. Corner pocket. Do I still have this? Yes. Give me that advantage. Oh my god, it's so powerful. Nothing will stand in my way. So I'm thinking of twinning this. Let me actually... So I'm going to try to step away, and I don't think that it's going to hit me. Not for any reason that I can point to, but I just don't think it'll hit me. And I'm going to twin this. No, I'm not. I'm not gonna twin it. I'm just gonna I'm just, th this one. I'm ready. Oh my god. How much damage do I do? Two to seven? Compared to two to twenty? Yes! Very good. Uh, and I'm. Dude, I, I think it's fine. I have enough heals. If this just like one shot. Oh my god, we're just too good. Reckless attack. One. Two. And there's Frenzied Strike. And we're gonna go three. And I should still have advantage on this attack, too, so I can. 95% chance to do my mega hit. Blood comes easy these days. Casual one. Okay, what what are the odds? 85%? Come on, beat it. Yes, clubbed. I've got a long road ahead. A long road ahead. Good stay crouched forever. Crown of Madness? Crown of Madness is some good stuff. How much do I have? Yeah, we probably need to transfer some stuff over. Dude, I have so much garbage on this hero. I really need to like sort through all of this and figure out everything that I actually want to do. Congratulations, Shadowheart. You carry garbage too now. Wow, these guys absorbed a lot of people. Ogre jelly, slime. This one got cooked. I wonder if the gods are watching me. I wonder. I have some serious questions about the status of the gods. So let's just start from the bottom up. Oh, there is a double door down here, yo. Fuck yeah. So let's go over here first. I'm going to work my way up to the stairwell. 634 already. I don't even believe it. Send that to camp. Oh. God, I love the 3D exploration of this. This is just this is just magnificent. Tired. Oh, I bet that links to this. Mm-hmm. Wish I had a bag of holding. 
Wish I had a bag of holding. Look, I can't believe these characters in this game are trolling me about that shit. Get it there, nuppy. Oh, dude, fuck yeah. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Get out of my frame. Get out of my frame. I mean, this game's pretty... And pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. So, I know that there's gonna be a bias to this answer. We're gonna ask it anyways. Um, are you thinking that... <laughs> oh, shit, it's another entrance. Hey, so, uh, for Game of the Year, this or Tears of the Kingdom? Because, I mean, I... I actually thought Tears of the Kingdom had... The, the starting tutorialization area was very, very, very weak. And it got sweet later on. But I never wound up playing it. Oh. What the? Hold it! I swear to Iron Hand. One more step and a blow is to chunks. An ashen scent fills the air. The barrel is filled with smoke powder. She's gonna blow up. That's my thing. Shut your mouth, Hoon! Or I'll shut you down. Hoon! Shut your mouth, Hoon! Dwergar, call me a Hoon again. You know, calm down. Let's talk this through. What's to say? Your near's bootlicker saw you sailing. A god's damn true soul. Oh, Better yeah. to die in this shit eat than rotting moonrise. You want me? Come get me. Intimidation. If I was a true soul, you'd be dead. All right. Smile sincerely and hold out your hand. Sure about this once you're dead. That's it. It's over. Detect thoughts. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now, you might be like, Sean, that's not the chaotic thing. Do keep in mind, I got Shadowheart killed and resurrected as a spore-infected corpse controlled by glut. So, I kind of think that it's chaotic, kind of go to the opposite end of things. So let's, let's actually persuasion this. Add a bonus. This and this. Nice. You what? Yeah, Dalek second. It, it took us took us like an hour and a half to figure out what to do. Don't do this. Don't pretend. No, probably a little less than that. Maybe like an hour. Give shit about me. Shit. I can't do it. Go on. Drag me to Moonrise. I'll make you cult nutters suffer. Uh, I don't, I don't want you. I will take that smoke powder, though. You want to barter with rune powder? Look, you have no idea what you're dealing with. Any true Iron Hand would trade their life for a grain of this stuff. Ah, oh, look at that. I'll spare you a vial. Uh, what good is a single vial? Wait, I'm confused. I'm just prickly. A barrel of this could light up the Underdark. A vial is plenty. Just let me go my way. Uh, so I'll so take all of it. Don't be stupid. We're parting ways here. Up to you in how many pieces. Okay, I'll take the vial. Don't throw it! Oh my god, didn't you just explain this to me? Oh my god. Well, I'll stuff that in my butt. Perfect. Continue. I go where there's shit to stir. And there's no shortage of options. I'm getting gone. You ought to do the same. Rune powder vial. Show me what what is this? 
damage. Holy shit. Whoa. Whoa. All right. Walking this way. Sharon's journal. Oh, that's Sharon. Tablet fragment. What? What? What is a tablet fragment? Of obeyance. The word of Catharic Tom is the word of Shah. Right, let me. Do these other ones have? Some sick shit. Sharon's journal. I'm reading this. Garlack, out of the way, please. Read. I saw a beast like it, but with muscle, tusks as long as my arms, scent of charred flesh, but I saw no flames. The stone might have been parchment. So quick did the creature charge through it. The other justice yards are dead, or close to it. Wasn't alone, Hell Knights too. Mass bulges to their faces like Pax on a keep wall. Trapped another rampage, yada yada, it's done. May Shars shadows keep me. Wow, took a week. Took a week. Oh my god, that's It's about one Liz Truss Prime Ministership worth of time. The joke is still relevant. Grim Forge of History. Oh, I'll read the history. I love history. Uh, we know little of the ones that came before, but we know they worshipped the Lady of Loss. We know they constructed the Great Fortress and named the next blah blah blah, but from whence they came and why they departed, it's a mystery even to Ketherick Thorm himself. Here, Thorm's dark justiciars shall rise! Sure. Sure, so, so seeing this in other inventory, is no attempt to use pouches to organize. I've got one for spells, one for arrows, one for potions. Or am I just neurotic? Uh, so, I mean... It, like, I, 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 this is gonna sound weird. If you've watched any of my other games, game streams where I'm, like, crafting, I love organization, but frankly, the fact that in this game I can do this and do type, and I can just kind of see them laid out accurately, I still would probably benefit from a shitload of organization, but, but this is the game. And if I start organizing, I love organizing so much, I'll never stop organizing. Mm. Uh. Ah. Mm. I'm going to come out this side, be a weirdo. So, so, this might be a bit of a silly question, but, um, I'm, I'm still Act 1, as far as I know. I mean, I'm still, I'm still in Act 1. How the hell did some of you beat Act 1 in less time than I am taking? I don't understand. Like, I really understand. Like, I mean, I know I, like, take time to talk about things. Maybe a little too much time. But shit, dude. Um, let's see here. Or let me, let me rephrase. I'm not talking about like, oh my god, I'm playing once a week for like five to six hours at a time. How did you get it faster than me? I mean like, in a it's literal sense. Stuff. Like, dude. Like, 45 hours is like my playtime right now. And I know people that beat Act 1 in like 15 hours. Hmm. What's that? Button. Huh. Oh, he 
some of you did early access. Ah, that makes a ton, ton, ton of sense. Oh my god, this area is just so... So beautifully laid out. Silver knife. I like silver. Last thing I'm gonna do on this stream is just sell all my shit. Rotten cheese wedge. This is some fucked up shit. Shadowheart is like, no, I took this oath, and yes, my brain has been erased, but I think severance is a good uh, procedure, and it, uh, you know, it's, it's amazing. Alright. Dude, severance is the greatest. If any of y'all haven't seen severance, you just need a just need to watch it. Just literally go watch it. Dude, I don't know why I'm, I want to collect the silver, but it says silver, so it feels valuable to me. Silver four? Yeah. This is actually a shitload of stuff. Spatula? Get out of here. Silver tray? Hell yeah. Severance single season? Not a complete single, uh, or not a complete run, but it is currently a single season. <laughs> it's finished. Easy. Feeling inspired. Oh! -ho! Opened it with a sneeze. No, never mind. Hey guys. Hi, I know you weren't expecting me to come from that way. Seems like a good moment to talk. Unless you're here to kick some stiffs lakeside, I suggest you bugger off. <laughs> Hello! Um, grim work. Uh, did you kill them? Nah. Rockfall smashed them. Can't have them stinking up the place. <laughs> the half that weren't crushed are digging the true soul out of the wreckage. Put your back into it, lazy bastards. Sod off, chump. I put more back in and I'm likely to break it. Shit. <laughs> Shit. Look at my cool hairdo. Perception. What? Why would I get myself destroyed? Dude, it's so good to have Shadowheart back. I perhaps I'm inspired still, maybe one time. Uh, yeah, I'm so inspired to look at corpses. Like, I can absolutely feel the inspiration flowing through my body! Shit. Shit! <laughs> okay. Failure, continue. Huh, I think that this is a dog. Mm. Done gawking. Lend a hand or get gone. Best keep your hands to yourself. You're being watched. How much right. further can I go? Whatever. Oh shit, we got a heavy chest over here. Oh! Ooh. I'm so rewarded. Take a big swig. Cure you right. Curse to put my hands on everything. Oh, I see. Anything over here? Hmm. What's that? Wow. 
perhaps an archway. I'm way too big. I'm way too big. So unnecessary. Send a camp. I mean, this is just so unnecessarily cool. And yet here it is. I mean, it's just so good. Uh, and then I go like this way. There we go. All right. Well, let me guess, no one can get into this and it's an elevator. All right, Skick Pit. Ward Pistol. Ward Magmar. Hey, Skid Pit. Another uh, stick shit. <laughs> Piss pot. Fuck you face. Flirt. Now jump to it. Or it's up to the lift. And straight to the shadows. Cruelty like that poisons a soul. Till one day, you drop dead. Or the person you're fucking with snaps and puts a sword in your eye. True soul, yeah. Tell the sergeant we won't move a pebble. Oh, your captain's most entertaining. How am I going to get on I heard True Soul is trapped. Shouldn't you be helping? Uh, you know what? I think Carlock will approve of this. Comfortably. Figured it obvious. I'll kick up my feet, order a brew, watch it work. No complain, but I love it. I'm telling you. All right. I don't like your attitude. And I don't like pig shit. But damned if your mouth ain't spewing it. Oh, that was a pretty good if comeback. You want respect, let your absolute pay for it. Till then, bugger off. Yeah, I started just like, oh, please, darling. Hey, why don't it. we? Where's my drink? <laughs> why don't we Come join right him? Up. Piss pot, stick shit, talks like smug, and he wrecked that shroom village. And then shagged it. <laughs> Here's to smug, nasty prick. All right. Yeah, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna deal with this later. I want to sell some stuff. Execute a drown. All right. Let's keep your hands to yourself. Oh, okay, okay. It's where Mermdurf is. Drow publicly displayed. What? What the shit? What the holy fuck? Hmm. Nothing amiss. Absolute must have took you in. Uh, where did the drow come from? Caught him sniffing around. Easy marks. Had the stench of the toplands. Hung them here as a warning. Ain't no one drugs with clan flame shade. Yes, yeah, I'm so mad. Me? Who else? My spiders sussed them out of hiding. Then near taught him a thing or two, and I let him fly. All right, leave. How do we fix Shadow Spore? She's all better, man. W where are they hung? Yo, this place is sick. I speak true, brothers. You know it in your hearts. You know it in your very souls. I don't Grinning like bugs. No Lolf, no Spider Queen. Father Murmuth is the head of Clan Lur. He hatched us, raised us, feeds us. This is so gross. What care we for his business here? He keeps us small, keeps us contained. We should be with the Spider Queen. Can I? Can I like cause a adored. spider mutiny here? Spiders for the Spider Queen seems logical. Uh, see how his immunity plays out. Uh, how about religion? Recall your learnings about the spider. Add a bonus. Guidance. One time. One time. One time. Oh, shit. Oh, God. I'm not rolling well at the end of the day. Everyone's tired. Nothing in particular comes to mind. <laughs> Father Mermoth is our past. Lolf is our future. Uh, persuasion. I mean, Mermath? Is that the guy who keeps telling everyone about his useless, hideous spiders? 
Add a bone. Oh, uh, that. Yeah. 26. Better than a one. Useless. Hideous. Xanta. Is it so? You see? Father Mermot's time has passed. Come, brothers. Follow me into Lolt's hairy Dude, the, 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 the twitching grace. motion of the legs. We follow. So gross. <laughs> yes. Now, brothers, Ugh. our new dawn awaits. Wait, 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 get back here. Where'd they go? Where'd they go? Where'd they go? There's another traitor over here, I believe. Here is how we go up. To oh, I'm, I'm going to the wrong area. So let's see. This kind of comes up to this way, and then yeah, oh, it just heads right up here. Great. Hmm. Oh God. I have hair in my mouth. Can't get it. Mm, I can't get it. I can't get it at all. This is so annoying. Elder. Seen her run with a barrel under her arm. Just a small one. But enough to blow the drow out. Someone should grab it. Slaves are never going to manage with pickaxes. Can't go chasing maybes. Mm. The sergeants are ticket in. Oh, would you look at that, Kerr? Someone's having a listen. A shiver runs through you. Your mind is awash with ancient resentments. It is? True soul, no less. What do you think, Kerr? Uh, should we take Nia's debt off him? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, I want near out. It sounds like you have a lead. I ain't parlaying with more twat souls. And you got the stench. If I didn't know better, I'd say a mind flayer shat a worm in your brain. Should split your head open and poke around in there if you lot don't pay up. Hmm. Stench, I'm no more true soul than you are. The shiver returns. This time it's colder. Sharper. The stench don't lie. You're one of them. Well, let's see here. Uh, cast detect thoughts. Yeah, I'm gonna detect thoughts. What is this? Oh, fuck. I didn't know this. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, fuck. I knew that I was gonna do it finally. Yes! No karmic dice over here. No karmic dice needed. Are you kidding me? Drugging true souls. Can still smell near from behind that damn wall. All right. Oh, uh, that's not me. You smell. He must be catching near scent. How about that? <laughs> he stinks to the deepest hells. That's for sure. Mm, could be all right. In that case, want to earn some gold? Give me all your gold. I want you to have some gold. No one's ever worked like this. Let's do it. Ah, uh, what gold? If I haven't been paid yet, ain't my gold I'm offering. It's the true souls. Oh Friends my God! It's its glory. Oh. That's why she's got those slaves digging for Nia. But we ain't need glory, just coin. And Nia's got plenty. Help Thrin free Nia. Then you and my chums grind him up. Whatever the spoils, right, we'll drop you a fat cut. Right. You in? I'm in. Uh, yes. Sounds good. I expect half the spoils. Friends. No one, no one's gotten mad at me yet, but you know, maybe it's like whatever.
24, yeah. Half. You drugnin. Fine. Half it is. But God, first, people are absolute wet napkins in this game. Something. You've seen that weird orb I floating about? Knife it. And don't get caught. The cult watches through it. And we can't risk more twat souls showing up. Is this a beholder? You still standing about? Get on it. Um. I was about to leave some answered. Some days back, a slave gnome bolted with smoke powder. Her crew know more than they're letting on. See, now move. Wait, wait, but you have. So I, want you, I want you to trade with me. Close the eye thing for good, then spring near. Okay, I thought that we could sell stuff to this dude. You stare into the eye. Your reflection stares back. The eye is unbothered by your prodding. All right, that's where we're saving. Save. Actually, no, I can just... I can just F5 it. Perfect. Poked it in the eye. And that is going to be it for the day. Now, I... Th I think what I'll probably highly likely end up doing eventually is just playing this again on Tuesday. Just playing it again on Tuesday. Because I'm going to be gone after that for about a week and a half. So, let's get some more Baldur's Gate 3 in next week just to keep everyone nice and happy. We got nothing to lose. And for now, I'm just gonna go. That was a blast. That was a huge uh, satisfaction. Do I wanna quit? Yeah, I'm out of here. Let's go ahead and raid somebody. Let's go ahead and raid somebody.